air crew teams from as far away as Alaska to Florida are racking up flight hours and saving lives because the Coast Guard has specialized skills needed for the extraction of people in desperate situations, like this Texas man who could have otherwise been swept away by rising floodwaters Saturday afternoon. Uh, this is the first time I've done land search and rescue in this condition where you're, you're dealing with floodwaters, down power lines, and every time you hoist someone in a different condition, it teaches you something new you can take away from it, and it makes you a better flight mech later on down the road. The Coast Guard Air Station, Houston, Texas, at Ellington Fields, has been a major hub in the Hurricane Rita response. One Coast Guardsman and his crew aboard an HH-60 Jayhawk helicopter conducted six emergency operations in one day alone. A hoist operator based out of Clearwater, Florida, explains how he's right. been able to rescue stranded hurricane victims. Now these are, shows us the equipment he uses. These are my hoist controls. I've got, this is a, a secondary control hoist pennant. It's your primary hoist pennant. And this is your backup control for your hoist. When I'm hoisting, I'm the eyes of the pilot. They can't see what we're hoisting to. So I'm actually telling them, uh, move left, move right, move this many feet forward, this many feet backwards, hold position. We're finding people where... You just, you can't believe that they're still in there. Uh, people are coming out. Uh, we pulled, our first group of people came out of the attic that we pulled out yesterday. Our second set of three people we found, one of them was sitting in a pickup truck, and he was, literally that truck must have been underwater prior to us finding him. He was in a life jacket. He must have been floating out and prescribed the first thing he found to hold on to. And I love to fly. I love search and rescue. I like being able to help people. It uh, gives you a good feeling when you pull someone into the helicopter that they didn't think they were going to be there at the end of the day. Your helicopter's there, and that's the only reason they're there. From Ellington Field, Senior Chris Evanson for Pentagon Channel News.